Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Taiwan on Fishing Productions. Today I'm going to go ahead and give you a quick overview of one of my favorite tools that I carry in my tackle bag, and especially when I'm on my kayak, and that's going to be the new fish grip right here. Alright, so this is a great alternative to not having to go and break into your piggy bank to go buy yourself a new bug of grip. And you know, you're going to spend over $100 on one of those easily, and this is a lot more inexpensive. It's made of durable uh, plastic. It's not going to break on you easily. You can drop it in the water and it's going to float. It's not going to sink like your $120, $150 bug of fish grip if you don't have a float on it. Um, it's a great alternative to using one of those. It's soft plastic. The, the plastic's not going to hurt the fish inside its mouth and anything like that. It's not going to injure it, later causing hemorrhage on the fish's mouth and later on causing the game fish to die in the water. Alright, so here's a few great examples of why you should go ahead and purchase yourself a new fish grip. One, it's over center locking grip to lock, flip to open. It's easy. Open, it opens, grip, it locks. It's, like, it's a unique jaw design. It holds the lip of the fish. It's made out of durable materials, plastic and stainless steel. So in other words, all these little metal, metal uh, pins are not going to rust in the water and salt water and so on. It's high visibility in color, it's easy to see during the day, and it's easy to see during the night. Shine a flashlight on this, it's going to glow in the water wherever you drop it in, no matter what, you'll be able to see it. It's got a weight scale slot right here. Enter your, just put your, put your scale hook through here, deduct 5 ounces off of this, which is the weight of this foot, uh, fish grip, and there you go, you can use it as a fish gripper, so you can go ahead and weigh your fish. Uh, it's got a wrist lanyard on it so that way you can go ahead and wrap it over your wrist that way you grab the fish out of the water in your kayak or in your boat it's not going to slip if the fish decides to pull his head it's not going to slip out of your hands and there goes your fish and then there goes your fish grip as well um, also a great quality about this it floats you drop it in the water it's not going to sink it's just going to stay floating in the water you pick it back up and you're ready to go now this is one of the newer fish grips that they came out with it's basically it's the same model it's the same concept as the older ones the only thing they changed different was the lanyard piece design and the new colors they come out in new colors now they have them in orange they still got the original glow in the dark one they got them in black i think as well and i think there might be one or two other colors um, this is one of the newer ones as you can see it's got one of those new wrist lanyards kind of like the tart bungees it's got the little ball in there so you can tighten it over your wrist as well slip your wrist through here and you tighten the little ball in there so that way when you grab the fish if the fish decides to jerk its head around you're not going to lose it out of your hands so it slips out the old style which is this one was my old one I broke this one unfortunately this is one of the glow in the dark ones the old style the lanyard was more of a flexi lanyard roll had a lot of play into it so you put that in your wrist it slips out of your hand you're gonna lose it but other than that that's a great concept I like the new lanyard design on here and other than that it's a great tool to use it's great to have in your tackle bag it doesn't weigh anything throw it in your kayak in your fishing boat in your bag no matter where you go when you're fishing the fish grip does good for you this at your local um, fishing tackle store or so I bought mine at a Walmart in Rockport Texas you can go ahead and get it for $13.96 uh, you can also go to Hobie's website, I think they carry them on there as well, or if not, actually go to uh, Austin Kayak and Canoe, they carry them on there for a couple dollars more, or I think you can go to also NortonBrassRattler.com. Thanks for watching, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed this episode. I hope this was very useful to y'all, and I hope to see a lot of more fish grips out there out in the water.